newly minted New York City FC club is set to debut in the Major League soccer team in Major League regular season in 2015. They acquired two stars, European stars, David Villa from Spain, the Spain striker, along with Chelsea mid midfielder Frank Lampard. And this is, I think, pretty a good welcoming for soccer in New York City, and they'll be playing at the Yankee Stadium. Wow. Um, I, I think it's uh, crickets. No, I'm just kidding. No, <laughs> no you know what I mean? No, it's big. Yeah. I mean, you even sound like you know what's going on with it. I, <laughs> I mean, I I don't I think, know who these guys are. Do, do you think I think, soccer, I think, I think it's a good. I think it's a good move. Um, yes. You bring in Frank. He's uh, Chelsea's leading goal scorer. You got mm -hmm. David Villa. He's a um, former Spanish Player of the Year. And, and he's in the World Cup. Yeah, he's in the World, World Cup. Yeah. It's pretty much. I mean, soccer doesn't really have a voice in the United States, even with the MLS. So you just need. I mean, and, and you look at the Rangers. Nobody really watches hockey, but they're in the Stanley Cup, out. and they're bringing in fans. In you have you bring in another team that can win. Maybe you generate some fans, give soccer some popularity. And, um, you know, in New York, and it, and it seems like they're following the, the tradition in <laughs> bringing in, um, like, high, high, uh, players. They yeah, have, high yeah. superior players that, you know, they want to win now. That's what New York's all about. Well, that's what they've been so, saying, though, for the yeah. last 15 years. We're going to bring these guys in. I mean, my boy, who's the poster boy, mm -hmm. or whatever, the Spice Girls husband. Oh, uh, David, David Beckham? Beckham. <laughs> he came in. He was supposed to set the world on fire. It's right. like $250 million. Yeah. Giving him a rod money, but I think <laughs> whatever that's. I think this, but I'm saying, I mean, uh, uh, the only thing I was gonna say is that celebrity bringing guy that you know that hasn't you know really worked its way yet. I yeah. think there's a possibility if this new World Cup brings some love to the United States. I mean, they may be able to play off that. But we've had some, yeah. we've had some good teams, especially on the women's side. Uh, I just don't know if soccer's ever, at least in this country ever going to be able to be one of the top four. Yeah. But I no, think, you do. I think yeah. the football club in New York City is a great start. Yeah. One, sure. New York City has one of the most multicultural areas yeah. in the United States. So I know I have a lot of friends you know, from Africa, from Asia, and they, all they talk about is football and soccer. Yeah. And, and Excuse me, football. football. Yeah. So all they talk, all they talk football. about is football. Uh, football. football. And, and, yeah. Uh, yeah. So I think it would be a great unifica unification yeah. uh, method for New York City. It will bring everybody together. Uh, different cultures, different yeah. people, different foods. So it'd be a really, really good idea for the football. Just keep in mind, there is also the New York Red Bulls. However, yeah. they play in Harrison, Definitely. New Jersey. Yeah. So the fact that they're playing in the Yankee exactly. Stadium in the Bronx, that yeah. might be easier and traction. Just, just the fact that they're they're playing within the five boroughs, fans are going to be interested. Right.